I realized I could vlog today, although probably should do it all on the camera, but we're starting here. So good morning, everybody. Today, April 30th, my hair is in rollers. Again, we're attempting some volume today. Um, it uh, The last time I did my rollers, one, I didn't do a, a wet set. I just did it dry and then hairsprayed the crap out of it. Um, and it left a little volume. It kind of went flat pretty fast, so I'm hoping wet set will do it for me. Um, I also <laughs> recently watched a, a Rachel Mixie video, and I always forget she has like a curl cream thing, and I'm like, I should get that. Um, but we'll see if the if the wet set, as you can see, I missed some pieces, but that's fine because I'm planning on curling it. But uh, today, tonight, going to Star Wars Night at Disney. Um, it's the first time I've ever been to any Disney After Dark event. Um, and I'm going with two of my friends. I'm going with actually my friend Tabitha's daughter, Brooke. <laughs> um, and then her best friend, Lauren. We've all become friends. Um, they're the ones I've helped make Mando costumes with um, and things like that. And so uh, we got to do a Disney bound, of course. Mandatory. Um, so we are doing an iconic Star Wars trio that is Ahsoka, Anakin, and Obi-Wan. And we can guess which one I am because I'm the oldest. <laughs> That's fucking Obi-Wan Kenobi. <laughs> <laughs> um, so thus the curlers, because we're doing Clone Wars era, um, trio, and I don't know if, I would imagine most of you have seen the Clone Wars movie, um, and also the TV show, but specifically in the movie, Ewan McGregor's hair is fabulous. Um, so my hair has to be fabulous. So I'm gonna try, it's Disney, so I feel like it'll also go flat, um, very soon. But, uh, yeah, I've got this. I dug out the teasing comb. We're gonna, we're gonna try. My hair normally doesn't, my hair is pretty much non-existent, so it normally doesn't do anything very well, except for being straight and flat. Um, which I know some that's some people's life goals for their hair is for it to be straight and flat. I just wish I had more. If I had like double the amount of hair that I currently have, I'd be so happy. Um, but mine's very thin, so you can see my scalp all over the place. Um, but yeah, uh, 9:30 a.m. I was hoping to sleep in until nine, and of course I was like awake at seven, and I was like way too early. So I kind of sat in a half sleep until about 8:30, um, and then I got up and I was like, "That's fine. I'll do my hair." And I'm the one driving because again, I'm the oldest one going um, and the most have the most driving experience. I've also driven to Disney on many occasions, so. Um, but yeah, so I gotta do my makeup, and then I gotta do the girls' makeup, and then we gotta get ready, and then we gotta leave. Um, one thing nice is because the event doesn't let us in to Disneyland until 6, so we are bypassing all of the traffic in order to get there. Um, Lauren, I think, is the only one out of all of us that have been to a Disney night, and uh, she's like, I think she she's like me, where we'd rather just be early. But honestly, I plan on being early-ish. Um, we've all been to Disneyland within the last two weeks, so it's not like we're missing or you know, missing out on anything. Um, but I'm very excited. I made these ears um, because they don't sell Obi-Wan ears, but uh, I made these like last yesterday slash last night. Um, I like the back. Um, that's kind of my thing. I did that on my, um, Bucky and Steve ears, as I had all the Avengers signatures on the back, so, uh, those are my ears. Um, yeah. I can't decide if I'm gonna start, because I don't want to have my makeup on too early, because I need it to, the event goes from 6 to 1am, so, I don't want my makeup to be all <laughs> by 1am. So I don't want to do it too early, but I also have to do my makeup first because I have to do their makeup next. 
why do I have seven text messages? Okay, well, it is what it is. Um, I'm going to probably continue to piddle around and clean up my room. I say clean up my room, but I mean, it's cleaner than it has been. Um, once I finish um, my desk and get everything, re I can actually like get things set up and reorganized and where they're gonna live for potentially a while. So there won't be as much mess. But, uh, and I also gotta pack my backpack. I think I'm actually gonna take a regular backpack instead of a lounge fly. Cause I wanna take my camera. I need to take a pair of backup shoes because I am wearing boots with a heel on them. Not a huge heel, like a like a two, one and a half inch, one almost uh, under two inch heel. Um, but uh, to Disneyland out of all places, so I gotta carry those. I also potentially am wearing my Jedi cloak, so I'm gonna have to carry that thing. And if it's too hot when we get there, because it's nice outside. But I'm going to be wearing so many layers that it might be too hot for me to wear my Jedi robe. So, uh, yeah. But, uh, yeah. I don't know. Duck. Go get him. Go get him. Scare him away. His kids are already doing that. Smile. Here's the camera. I'm sorry. We talk later. We have to do everything around him. Yes, yes. Hello, hello, my friends. I am Hondo Onaka, and this is Onaka Transport Solutions. <laughs> Turn up a storm with no music. <laughs> there they go. 